Should you hire a business coach for your construction business? Aren't they all just snake oil salesmen? In this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you four different questions that you need to ask yourself if you're thinking about getting a business coach. All right, so full disclosure, I am a construction business coach. I help uh, construction businesses with their processes, their systems, just building their business from the ground up, getting into those details, getting those procedures and policies in place, all that fun stuff that most business owners don't enjoy. So I'm speaking from experience, both from being a business coach, as well as I've hired uh, four or five different coaches throughout my career uh, for different businesses and for different roles, I guess, if you would say. So uh, I'm building off that experience. The first question that you need to ask yourself is, how do I find a good coach, right? Where do you look? How do you find one um, that's going to be a good fit? So we're going to get over this pretty quick. So you're going to ask other business owners in your network. That's the first place I'd always start when you're looking for people. Ask for referrals. Ask who the other people have gone with somebody in your network. If that doesn't work or you don't find anybody or you want to, you know, see some alternatives, you know, asking groups. So if you're at a networking event, if you've got a different business group that maybe you're like a mastermind group or something that you're part of, uh, Facebook groups, you know, drop it in there and see if you get some referrals some people that you can get in contact with. And then uh, the last option would be just to do an online search, right? Search your local area, business coach um, in construction or the certain trade that you're in, uh, if there is one that's specific. And uh, pretty much just do your due diligence, look into them and, and get on, you know, a discovery call and see if they are going to be someone that's going to help you uh, move the needle in your business. So that's the first question. The second question is, how knowledgeable are they? You might want to know um, what knowledge level the coach, the consultant, whoever you're going to be hiring has. So there's kind of three different levels. And the first one is done, uh, done it before. So the, the best thing that you can hire someone to help you with is someone who's done what you want to do before, right? If they've grown a business and to a size or done work in a business that they have specifically done that hands-on type work of building a business, of doing the sales, doing the marketing, doing the project management, the um, the HR, whatever. They're going to be know you know what they're doing. The second one is they've helped others do it. So there's another level of knowledge where maybe they haven't done it themselves, or maybe they have done it themselves, but they've also helped other people do it. So it's like it's a little bit different of a skill to be able to help others do something. There's a lot of people that can like do it themselves, but have they helped others do it as well? And then there's the kind of the lowest level of knowledge, which is you've learned about it, right? So you've watched a YouTube video, you've read some books, um, you've, you've learned, um, you know, from somebody else or maybe even from a coach. So there's that level of knowledge would be kind of like your base knowledge where you've learned it, but you haven't actually done it. And you want to know this about your coach. What have they done specifically that coincides with your business and where you want to go. So that's the second question to ask. Third question, moving on to number three. What is value? So there's gonna be a price for the coaching, uh, generally, unless you lucked out um, and got one that was pro bono or you know a mentor that can, can uh, kind of coach you throughout um, your career. Uh, but generally, there's gonna be a cost to coaching and that can range. You know, I've paid, uh, anywhere from a few thousand dollars to tens of thousands of dollars. I know coaches, you know, of super high levels are going to be even beyond that. Um, so what are you getting for that, that dollar value, you know, like dollar amount? What is the value? So do they have courses? Do they have templates that they're giving you programs, um, subscriptions? Uh, is this like, you know, are you doing it yourself, the work? Like they're just, you know, helping you through these problems. Are they actually doing the work with you? Do they have a team that can do um, some of this work for you? Is there a specific specialization, right? So my specialty is in systems and the procedures and processes of a business. Um, I know a lot more outside of that, but that's where I specialize. So what are they specializing? Maybe they specialize in HR or production or a specific thing. Um, what's the value of that? Connections and network, right? So a business coach is generally going to be someone who's owned businesses, who's networked, who knows a lot of people in key positions, knows a lot of different business owners. Uh, so what is their network worth? Are they willing to refer people to you uh, that could help you in your business, whether that's tradespeople, 
whether that's other business connections, whether that's maybe investors or other people that can sponsor or help you with your business. So what is their network um, and, and is that a value to you? <clears throat> then of course, price, right? Um, what are you gonna be getting? Um, and is there, does the value match the price? Is it a good return on your investment? And you can ask the coach, like, what, you know, what am I getting for this, um, this cost? And when do you, when would I get my return on investment? You know, what, what's the upside here for myself? So that's the third question is, is what is the value? The fourth one, um, question you want to ask and probably the most important one is, is coaching right for you? So is the coach right for you? And is coaching right for you at this time? Generally speaking, coaching is always going to be a good idea for business. Uh, timing may be an issue. But essentially, you're just going to have a much easier, better time. You're going to avoid a whole bunch of mistakes. Your business is going to be so much farther ahead by getting coaching. Uh, I mentioned earlier that I had four different coaches. Um, they all helped me in different ways, and I'm all I'm glad for every and each one of them um, that I got the coaching help that I did. Some of them were better than others. Some of them I may have overpaid for, and I maybe didn't get a whole lot of value, but I did learn some essential things. So, and they all helped me at different stages of my career, but. As far as the coaching is right for you, you got to ask yourself timing. Um, you know, how does the money look? Often with like sales and marketing, as well as with coaching, the results are going to come. There's going to be a lag, right? You're going to learn the information. You're going to get the systems, uh, templates, processes, uh, whatever is included with the coaching. You're going to get all that. You're going to put it into your business. There's going to be an implementation period. And then there's going to be a period where you have to work the system and it's going to take some time before those results get back to you. So is the timing right to make that investment? Um, does it make financial sense? And then what are the expectations? Be very clear, you know, like with the coach, what's the expectations of like what you expect to get from them and what the results are, the time frames, all that stuff. If the coach isn't going through that with you, you need to be able to ask that and get some somewhat specific answers as far as what to expect uh, for you as well as the coach. So if you follow those four things and ask those questions, then you should be well on your way to getting proper coaching and help. If you want help with this, reach out to me. Uh, I help construction business owners, tradespeople, contractors, systematize their business, start building out those processes so you can get out of the day-to-day, -day, get more time with your family, get more profit in the bank, all that good stuff. Links are in the description below to reach out to me as well as to get a free course on how to build a business that works without you. Wonderful resource. Get the course, get signed up, go through it. It's not very long, but a ton of value in there. I'll see you on the next video.